I've put together a 100 plus Christmas gift guide for 2022. Let's talk about it. I know that there are thousands of these kind of videos, but I just wanted to hop on a trend. And since I'm filming a Vlogmas this December, I thought it would be so soothing and fitting. I wrote down different categories, so we're just going through the categories. Beauty, hair and skincare, electronics, clothing and accessories, shoes, travel, lifestyle, experience and stocking stuffers as a little bonus. Well, let's start with the first category, beauty, hair and skincare. So it's a long list. We're gonna start with this one because I like this list a lot. And of course I had to start with Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Skin Filter. I love this product. Honestly, everything Charlotte Tilbury is a great gift because I love all her products I've used so far. Then the Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm. I'm wearing it right now. There are a lot of pretty colors in her collection. A mini Laneige lip mask set. Then you can try like four or five different little scents or flavors they have, which I think is such a fun gift idea. Gizu hair oil. I really, really love this product. I think they also have gift sets or a multi-pack of Gizu products. Also a very good gift idea. A mini skincare fridge. I would love to have one, honestly, because I think it's so good to cool your skincare products and rollers and all those things. A makeup subscription box, also very fun, like for maybe a few months, half a year, even a year. For example, BoxyCharm or I, th I think it's called Ipsy, an ice roller. It's such a trend right now. I also ask it for Christmas this year for myself. Or any face massage rollers. I really like the Body Shop ones. A skincare headband. If somebody loves skincare, then this is such a sort of necessity, I think. Hair tools. And then I'm talking about hot tools. For example, the Dyson Airwrap, if there's a very big budget. <laughs> or a curling iron or a flat iron. I like the brand Babyliss. Then Heatless hair tools. Velcro rollers are very nice after doing like a blowout and then put your hand in a Velcro roller. I don't know the name of it. The thing to make rope curls, pimple patches, reusable makeup remover pads, a scalp massager, a lash serum is also very, very nice. I use the Ordinary and I think it's worth Working, so that's a tip. I've heard good things about the one from Lancome and also the word Vita Lash or Vita Lash. I've heard a lot of good things about those. A body care set is also so fun to give or to get. A basket involving body wash, body lotion, body oil, and a body scrub, loofah, or a scrub glove. A makeup brush holder, like a cup or even like a travel size one, also nice. Then for the next category, clothing and accessories a puffer jacket you can find those everywhere and i feel like a lot of people like them i have a faux leather one from zara I already have it for two years and i still love it so much the north face also has very nice ones with a fur coat or just a plain black one a blazer from jerv avenue i never own anything from jerv avenue but her blazers are like really really pretty some workout clothes or gym clothing. For example, Lululemon, Gymshark or Set Active. They have a lot of great pieces. Ooh, something I really, really like are pantyhose. Cute ones with some dots or a stripe or even rhinestones. And I highly recommend going to Calcedonia. They have amazing, amazing pantyhose. PJs. I love PJ sets. I don't know, I'm always happy when I'm wearing a new PJ set. For example, Victoria's Secret, of course, always has good ones. Or Intimacy Me, I hope I pronounce it well. <laughs> Pretty Little Thing also has very nice and more luxurious looking PJs like satin and all those things and silk really like them then anything skims again don't have anything from skims but i've heard great great reviews i would love to have that long dress with a spaghetti strap maybe for summer or something would be such a cute one or the basic tops also re very nice a nike crew neck i think they're so basic but so cute at the same time if you know what i mean blue light glasses we live in an era that laptop ipad phones all those things are always being used. So blue light glasses I think are very nice to have. The Ugg earmuffs, 
so 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 cute a claw clip set or just one claw clip i feel like amazon has great ones h&m also has very nice ones a new york yankees baseball cap i think that will always be on trend and they have so many cool colors like very basic cream black white but also red and blue and all those things some nike socks or any white sports socks i really like the high ones from nike but also the quarter ones so the one that just goes over your ankle talking about socks Thick, comfy socks like Christmas socks, soft socks, always nice to have, always nice to get. A cool phone case. You can even personalize phone cases like Caseify or Ideal Sweden. Really nice places with a very big variety of phone cases. Jewelry, for example, Nature for more chunkier items. It's the brand of Romy Street. Stride. <laughs> and her fiance. But if you're looking for more dainty jewelry, I highly recommend PD Paula. I love their items. They have so many cute, dainty little jewelry pieces. And then for more of a splurge, the tote bag from Marc Jacobs. I think it's such a cute one, like the medium size one. I think that one is so cute. Then let's move on to shoes. Of course, I had to include this one, but mini Uggs. Air Jordan 1s are very nice. Nike Dunks, also so cute. Nike Blazers, also very cool. The New Balance 550 ones and Converse, so timeless. Okay, this was a list full of sneakers, but cowboy boots, also very nice. Like high ones that go all the way up to your knee or maybe like medium ones. Such cool boots, I think, to have in your collection. And house slippers, mostly during these cold days, it's nice to wear like very warm house slippers. Ugg has nice ones, of course. H&M also has very nice ones. And then let's go to electronics. The Apple headphones are very trendy right now. Pretty expensive, but a good gift, I think. I really like the Beats by Dr. Dre headphones. I already have them for years and years and years, and I'm still very happy with those. AirPods, and if you're gifting someone AirPods, or you know that somebody already has AirPods, a AirPod case, a film camera, you can go like very high in pricing and in quality, but you can also, of course, just give a set of a few disposable film cameras. I really like the style of disposable cameras. A mini photo printer, for example, from a HP, so you can roll out those photos right away. Polaroid camera, a ring light. Nice to give to someone who likes taking pictures or making videos or anything. A laptop holder or a laptop stand. And then you can also give a keyboard, a laptop case, a hardcover one, or just like a laptop sort of socket, you know? And then for the category travel, a skincare mini set. I think it's great to have a mini set at home for whenever you're gonna travel. Personalized bag tag i think that's so cute i think you can buy them at etsy or something the tags that you can put on your suitcase when traveling apple air tag so convenient travel cubes a suitcase or carry-on i really like the suit suit ones super expensive but so cute sleeping mask for on the plane then i have this very big category which is lifestyle first one a bible i think it's so nice to have your own bible even though you can like download a bible on your phone or your ipad or something but i think it's so nice to have like a physical bible i asked one for christmas this year from it's a dutch website dagelijkse broodkruimel i think but it's a set so it comes with a bible a journal a daily journal and a daily devotional journal thing if you know that somebody already has a bible you can also give a daily devotional booklet or journal then of course i have to include books if you know that somebody likes to read then books are the way to go. Colleen Hoover has amazing books. The Shatter Me series, very nice. I also really like Darling Venom. Then a candle set from Zara Home. Very specific, but I love that scent. I think burnt caramel, I don't know, but it smells amazing. It comes with a little candle and then some sticks, a room sprayer or something, but they have multiple, like multiple sizing and everything. A candle wick trimmer, bath bombs or bubble bars, always a good gift to give. Okay, I really like this one. I once gave this to my parents. It's a coffee set. So you make a whole complete package. So a coffee machine, a milk frother, ground coffee or coffee capsules or coffee pads, some sort of fun syrup. You can go very basic with caramel or vanilla but you can also go like more seasonal like gingerbread or uh, 
peppermint and then combine it with a cute mug. Anthropology has amazing, amazing mugs. Coffee table books, a cute vase. I saw so many cute ones on the H&M website. Flower subscription, I think that's such a cool gift. If you know that somebody loves flowers, then you can give them a subscription so they can get flowers every week or every two weeks for maybe a few months or even a year. I think that's so, so cute. Bed sheet sets, I know that Zara Home has great ones. A silk pillowcase, good for the hair, good for the skin. A car stuff kit, so you can give hands sanitizer, wet wipes, chewing gum, chapstick, air freshener, tissues, mini deodorant, maybe some snacks. I think it's nice to give that to somebody who drives their car a lot. I think it's such a cute idea. And they're all like mini sizes, so they can even put it in the consult thingy. <laughs> a heating blanket for the people who tend to get very cold during the night. A matcha starter kit, so it comes with matcha powder, a little bowl and that matcha whisk, some luxurious teas, for example, Mariage Frère or Damant Frère. I think those are French brands, but their teas are legit. They're so, so tasty. Reusable straws, glass or metal. A Starbucks cold cup. I think it's always so cute to see those Starbucks cold cups. You can buy them, of course, at Starbucks, but you can even order them on Etsy and you can even let them personalize your cups which i think is so cute and, per and also a very personal gift a jewelry organizer good quality kitchen knives for somebody who likes to cook we use global yoshikin knives very good ones they're japanese knives a planner for 2023 a vanity tray i saw some cute ones at anthropology like the mirror vanity trays for example a cocktail making set also so fun. So it comes with a cocktail shaker, maybe even a recipe, and then you can give the ingredients for one type of cocktail. A charcuterie board set, so you can give the actual wooden charcuterie board, and then some cheese knives, some little bowls, and those picks or sticks to pick up some olives. Cocktail glasses, also very nice, like martini glasses or cute whiskey glasses. Christmas tableware, I love that. Mama is addicted to cute cups and mugs and like sets of everything so I think a Christmas style tableware set very cute then we have the category experience usually you think about actual gifts to give but you can also of course give somebody like something you can do together or experience for that person for example a spa day together high tea you can go very extravagant over here in the Netherlands you have the Duchess which is amazing to go to for an afternoon tea concert tickets a museum membership for somebody who likes to go visit exhibitions or museums theater tickets a wine tasting so fun I think a Spotify subscription for somebody who uses the Spotify free version you can give them like a premium version or any streaming subscription for example Netflix Amazon Prime Disney Plus and then for the sort of extra category stocking stuffers we don't have that at our house I would love to do that when I have my own house one day the best stocking stuffer gift you can give I think is a Starbucks gift card for example you can put 10 euros on it or ten dollars or something mini Charlotte Tilbury items a mini kit of for example the Charlotte Tilbury lip glosses or even the mini pillow talk set sheet masks and then particularly the Korean skincare brands card games I love playing games a bag hanger it may sound so random but I don't like to put my purses or my bags on the floor so I like to hang my bags on the table also a great stocking stuffer gift nail polish I used to like OPI and SE now I go to nail salon for my nails, so I don't need nail polish anymore. But for somebody who likes to use nail polish, scrunchies. I think those boutique style shops have great ones. A Christmas tree ornament. And you can make it like an annual thing. I think that's so cool to collect Christmas ornaments for somebody else. And then the last one is an advent calendar. I honestly don't know when you hang your stockings. But, but if you have them on December 1st, you can give an advent calendar. You can give a very basic one filled with chocolates, but you can also buy a beauty advent calendar. And this sums up the 100 plus gift guide 
2022. I really enjoyed thinking about lists and all those things. I hope that I've helped you a little bit with coming up with Christmas gifts. And if you have any other ideas on Christmas gifts, then please leave them down below in the comments. I would love to know the things that you have on your wish list or the things that you're planning on giving to your loved ones. Let me know down below in the comments. I'm very curious. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Bye guys.